In a world where energy stability is the bedrock of development, Ghana finds itself grappling with an erratic power supply that stifles growth and disrupts daily life. However, a beacon of hope emerges from the realm of nuclear energy, championed by Dr. Stephen Yamoa, the Executive Director of Nuclear Power Ghana, NPG. Dr. Yamoa's unwavering belief in the potential of nuclear power to transform Ghana's energy landscape underscores the nation's quest to diversify its energy mix and achieve energy security. Those of you watching who haven't yet subscribed to our channel, please do so now. Your support helps us bring you more insightful content and reach our goal of 30,000 subscribers by the end of the month. Hit the subscribe button and join us on this journey. Ghana's journey towards embracing nuclear energy is not merely a theoretical exercise, but a concrete, strategic move to bolster its energy infrastructure. In recent times, the Ministry of Energy and NPG have been actively engaged on the international stage, forging crucial partnerships and evaluating proposals that promise to deliver state-of-the-art nuclear technology to the country. These efforts have culminated in several significant agreements that lay the foundation for Ghana's nuclear future. Among these agreements is a cooperation and framework agreement between NPG and CNNC Overseas Limited. This agreement paves the way for the construction of a large reactor project and the upgrading of Ghana's grid infrastructure. The goal is to accommodate the additional power generated and ensure efficient distribution across the nation, thus stabilizing the energy supply and supporting economic growth. Moreover, Ghana has recently signed two memorandums of understanding, MOUs, UNUs, with the United States, represented by the Ghana Atomic Energy Commission, E. These MOUs include the establishment of a regional welding certification program and a contractual agreement for the provision of a new scale exploration E2 center at GAEC. The Regional Welding Certification Initiative is particularly noteworthy as it aims to develop a comprehensive training program that will equip Ghanaian technicians with specialized welding skills essential for nuclear power construction projects. The New Scale Exploration Center is another cornerstone of Ghana's nuclear ambition. Uh, this simulator facility replicates New Scale Power's small modular reactor, SMR control room, providing hands-on training for future nuclear operators and engineers. It will serve as a regional hub for nuclear education and training, supporting safe and secure civil nuclear deployments across Africa. These initiatives underscore the trust and confidence international partners have in Ghana's nuclear power efforts, highlighting the strong relationships and mutual willingness to see the project through to fruition. Dr. Yamoa stresses the indispensable role of the media in this transformative journey. The media's involvement is critical in ensuring that the public embraces nuclear power as a clean, secure, safe, and reliable energy source. Over the years, uh, the media has been instrumental in providing public education and awareness, demystifying misconceptions and fostering a well-informed populace. By delivering transparent and factual information about the project's progress, safety measures, and regulatory frameworks, the media builds public trust and facilitates informed discussions on nuclear power. At a recent three-day workshop for journalists in Accra, themed Media Support for the Nuclear Power Project, The Journey So Far, Dr. Yamoa highlighted the importance of media collaboration. He urged journalists to facilitate discussions and debates on nuclear power to address public concerns and garner support for the project. The workshop, attended by over 30 journalists from various media platforms, emphasized the need for accurate and effective reportage on Ghana's nuclear power journey. Albert Kwabena Dwumfor, president of the Ghana Journalists Association, GJA, reinforced the cleanliness and safety of nuclear power in his address. He highlighted nuclear power as a reliable energy source and called on journalists to educate the public on its importance for a low carbon future. Mr. Dwumfor pledged the GJA's commitment to fostering opportunities for discussions and supporting the nuclear power narrative. The journey towards nuclear energy is not without its challenges, but the potential benefits far outweigh the hurdles. Nuclear power offers a sustainable solution to Ghana's energy woes, providing a reliable and clean energy source that can drive industrial growth and improve the quality of life for its citizens. As Ghana navigates this complex landscape, the collaboration between government bodies, international partners, and the media 
will be crucial in ensuring the successful implementation of nuclear power projects. Ghana moves forward with its nuclear ambitions. It is essential for all stakeholders to work together towards a common goal. The government, industry experts, the media, and the public must engage in continuous dialogue to address concerns, share progress, and celebrate milestones. This collaborative approach will ensure that nuclear power becomes a cornerstone of Ghana's energy strategy, providing a stable and sustainable energy supply for generations to come. In conclusion, the promise of nuclear power in Ghana is not just a dream, but a viable solution to the country's energy challenges. With dedicated efforts from all sectors, Ghana is poised to become a leader in nuclear energy in Africa, uh, setting an example for other nations to follow. Let us all embrace this opportunity to create a brighter, more sustainable future for Ghana and beyond. If today is your first time watching this channel or you are returning to the channel for the exciting content, please subscribe to the channel for more educative and developmental projects across Ghana and Africa as a whole. Do you want to know about the state of a project in Africa? Then make sure to like and comment the name of the project you would like us to talk about and its current state.